Hey guys, I'm Carl and welcome back to SMA. So a really crazy thing just happened. I had this idea that I was going to release a video and put it out there on YouTube talking about surviving middle age. And then something even crazier happened. People actually watched the thing. My intention was I was going to put this out there. It was going to be a learning experience. You know, maybe 10 or 15 of my friends would check it out. Maybe they would subscribe. But beyond that, maybe 40, 50 views max. And 10 of those would be me just leaving the thing in a loop going at work all day long. But what actually happened was within the first 12 hours, we had over 400 views and over 100 subscribers. And that was just crazy. Then on top of that, I had an interview today with a gentleman from Men's Health Magazine to talk about the channel. So there's going to be a little bit more uh, advertisement for the channel. So it really took off in a way that I had never considered, how I would never have expected. That sounds like good news, right? Like everything is going full guns blazing, so I should be super excited. Well, actually, that's where the problem comes in. My expectation, again, was that this was going to be experimental for a while, that it would probably be, you know, three to six months before anybody actually saw the channel. If you, when I wrote out my plan for how this channel was going to be set up, this was actually going to be the soft launch. And here's something else I found out when I launched my channel. I found out that whoever these 130 or so odd subscribers are, not a one of them is my dad. Because when I told my dad, hey, I launched a YouTube channel, his response was, I don't have cable, so I guess I'm not going to be able to watch. So, one would assume that having a, a strong start would make me excited, make me happy, and everything would be roses, right? We're going out guns blazing, everything's beautiful. Well, that's kind of true. And then there's the more honest side of me, which says, I am terrified. You see, because I thought this was going to be experimental, because I thought I was going to have this three to six month period where nothing was going to happen, I had time to make my mistakes, to figure out my editing, to figure out my sound, to figure out all the things that would make the channel what it is once people started paying attention. But apparently people are paying attention, so now I have to play catch up a little bit. So here's where we're at. When I started off, one of the things I wanted to do was I wanted to have a bunch of videos in the can. I wanted to make sure that I could hit this every Tuesday uh, deadline and that if I got sick, if I went on vacation, that I wouldn't miss it. So I ended up filming roughly seven videos, of which one has already been released. So I have six more ready to go. Because of this, they're probably not as good of videos as I would have hoped to have been able to give you out the gate. One of the things I'm going to do is I think I'm going to refilm one of my videos. I think uh, video number three, which is supposed to be how to achieve your bucket list, um, is probably going to get re-recorded. And odds are I'm going to forget to tell my wife about this. So tomorrow when this thing airs and she takes a look at it, she's going to be like, I didn't know we were going to refilm that. Eh, surprises happen. I'm going to try to fix what's already out there a little bit. There's only so much I can do at this point. Um, I'm going to refilm one. But just know the videos get better as they go. You know, a lot of people had comments about the audio and that the audio wasn't very good. And uh, they suggested I bought a mic. Well, just so you know, I did buy a mic um, and it actually is going on several of the uh, several of the videos. In fact, every video going from here forward does have a mic attached to it. The sound should get better. Video three, which is the one I'm going to re-record, had some sound issues. So hopefully we're going to be able to fix that on the re-record and things will get better. So just to let you know where we're going and what, what we got going on. Finally, so I've got a few videos in the can. Then uh, I've got a vacation coming up and I'll have some stuff about that. When I get back from vacation, one of the first things I'm going to cover is um, last week, I think it's last week, um, my father-in-law passed away. And that was a very hard thing for me and my family. And it just got me thinking that this is something that we deal with um, at this stage of life, aging parents. So I have a friend who wrote a book on the subject, and we're going to get together and I'm going to do an interview with him. We're going to talk about having aging parents and losing a parent um, at this stage in life. So 
Thanks again for all the support. It's been amazing. I'm super excited as well as scared. Thank you for stopping by. Hang in there. We got better stuff coming your way. Take care.